welcome to the video demonstration for Guard's Altusax gig bag. The bag here is the synthetic bag model 104 MSK which is made out of 1680 denier fabric. Guard also makes exactly the same bag in full leather which is model 104 MLK. And today I'm going to demonstrate and show you how to fit your alto saxophone correctly into the bag and make the best use of Guard's patented mid-bag suspension system. Guard has been manufacturing kick bags and wheelies for more than 20 years. The model you see here is the fourth generation of the bag. Over the years, we continually get, receive feedback and speak with our customers and students who use our products. We read the uh, reviews on various sites, on Amazon, on Woodwind Brasswin and Musicians for Friends. And based on the feedback, we continue to improvise on the bag. This generation, the fourth generation 104 MSK, is actually a hybrid. It's between what we call a kick bag and a hard case. The reason I call it a hybrid is because it's really light as a kick bag, but in terms of protection, it provides as good a protection as a hard case. And the reason for that is the thing you see here. This is a special polymer that Guard is using for its new generation of bags. This two millimeter thick sheet is actually almost ballistic, which means that you, you know any sharp object cannot go in to pierce it. And this material is used all over the bag. You cannot see it because it's inside. This sheet here is actually stitched between the outer synthetic fabric and the inner soft fabric. And it's on the sides, it's on the back, it's all over the back. Before I explain the mid-back suspension and show you how to set up your alto sax for the bag, let me talk a little bit about the materials that have gone into the making of the bag. The outside fabric that you see is a 1680 denier synthetic fabric that we procured from Korea. The handles, all the trims, the rivets, and the top handle here, these are all made out of real leather. You can see it, it smells very nice. Love the smell of leather. And then uh, the zipper, the zipper we are using, these are all from YKK, we are procuring them. They are the best zippers available in the market. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the interior fabric. Uh, the Velcro, by the way, comes from Japan, a, a Japanese company called Kurare. We are procuring it from them. And then when we talk about the interior fabric, there is a special napped fabric that we are getting from uh, uh, Taiwan that we are using for the interior. This is soft and at the same time the Velcro will stick to it. That's the speciality of the fabric. You see the Velcro here? It sticks onto any part of uh, the bag because that's how, what the interior is made out of. The sides, the side of the bag as you can see has a dense 20 millimeter foam. Um, it's hard foam, it's not just any foam. It's, it's a dense hard foam that is specially made for us. Now I'm going to show you how to set up the bag for your alto sax saxophone. Um, and also explain the mid-bag suspension system which is guards patented. Um, so the mid-bag suspension consists of these, the cone and the foam belts and the cushions that you see all around the bag. And these are actually uh, set up in such, such a way so that they hold the instrument by the uh, robust parts and all the critical elements of the instruments are protected from impact from all the side. So for the saxophone, you see the cone here goes into the bell. However, this part is the part that attaches to the side. So the lip of the saxophone is actually suspended in mid-air. It's not touching any parts of the bag because when you close it, the cone goes inside, the zipper comes on the side and in this side you have the two foam bells and the cone and basically this whole thing is suspended mid-air. That's the beauty of the mid-bag suspension system. Here, I'll take out the saxophone here for demonstration I have a Yamaha, beautiful saxophone by Yamaha and now you can see the inside bells. At the bottom there is a uh, like a cushion at the bottom which has a wooden wooden back and then these bells are uh, removable and adjustable based on the height of the instrument. Although it's a uh, bag for a alto sax but this bag if needed can also be used for a curved soprano which is smaller in size but by adjusting the uh, different foams and pillows so you can still carry your curved soprano safely. That's the beauty of the guard's mid-back suspension that it can fit the bag to customize the size of your instrument. 
Now I'm going to show you how to set up the mid-back suspension system for the alto saxophone. First we'll remove the neck of the saxophone and all card uh, gig bags and also the uh, PDs actually come with a pouch to store your, your neck which we'll set up later. I'm also keeping the mouthpiece separate and here you can see um, that we have uh, a reed case, uh, a digital uh, metronome and a cleaning cloth and a cork grease. The bottom part of the bell will rest here so that does not need, uh, you know, there's no need to make any changes to that. This is how the bag comes with it. It's the middle and the top, the two cushions we have here. Okay, these are removable, they have Velcro and you want to adjust it across the, uh, you know, the main body of the saxophone to make sure that none of the keys are getting pressed. That's the, the most important part is that when you're setting the bag up, that the keys should not be depressed when you're setting it up. And you can see here that the bottom bell will go here and then the back part of the, of the horn is going to rest against the back of the bag. And while you're doing this, we've ensured that none of the keys are getting pressed. Then comes the most important part, how to set up the, uh, you know, the cone inside the bell. The cone goes inside the bell of the alto sax. And this part here actually comes on top. So this way, when we, once we set this up, we will slowly bring this up. And you want to make sure the cone goes in because here it's, you know, it's set up. So now every time when you have to remove your bag, you don't need to change the position because the cone is already set up to go inside the bell. Put it here, and the top part goes through here, and there is a velcro at the back. And once we've done it, we zip up the sides of the bag, and your auto saxophone is already set up. You can, you know, you can shake and see if there's no movement. The bag is actually pretty firm inside. Okay. Now we talk about the pockets. You can see the bag has two side pockets. They also have a velvet interior, which is again given to make sure that if you put anything made out of metal, there are no scratches on it. Same size pockets on both sides. On this side, we're going to set up the, the neck, which goes in here, goes at the bottom, and then there is before you do that, you want to make sure that you put your um, mouthpiece there. So all this fitted on this side. Left with the cork grease, there's enough space to keep it here. Now you're wondering why do I have an empty pocket on this side? And the reason for that is actually the side strap. The backpack straps that the bag comes with can be taken off if you don't want them. You know, when you're going on a plane um, and when you're carrying the bag from the top, you don't want the backpack, that's when you put it. And the reason it comes with the backpack strap is if you're bicycling or you're going up a flight of stairs, then it's easy for you to put it on your back rather than carry it all the way. And these backpack straps actually easily fit onto the side. That's what I'm doing right now. fit here. That's pretty snug. And then bag is set up. You can see, let's look at the behind of the bag. There are metal studs here so that if you keep it here, it protects the fabric from getting dirty. And also on the bottom part, there are four metal studs that come standard with the bag. Uh, finally, let me show you how to set up the backpack for the guard ultra sax. Uh, one thing to note is the backpack actually have padded foam inside, so it's comfortable on your shoulder. And uh, they come with this camera lock or you know the clicking thing that goes in here. One at the top, one at the bottom on each side. Okay, I'm going to turn the bag around and set up the second one here. Uh, the foam part actually clicks on top, that's what I'm doing here. And then this is adjustable like you see based on your, uh, if you're tall 
Or you can easily adjust the strap, it's not a problem. Easily done. Close here. Okay. And we're all set. Guards 104 MSK Auto Sax kickback also comes with its own rain jacket or rain cover. This rain cover actually protects the leather parts from heavy rain. The fabric itself is water resistant and waterproof, but the leather parts are what we want to protect with. So if there is heavy rain, you just put on the rain jacket that goes over like this. And all guard, trumpet, saxophone, the entire range of our bags come with a rain jacket like this. There's also a reflected logo here, so if you're bicycling in the night, it will help a person behind you who's driving a car. You make you easily visible in the night so that the people around you can see that you're bicycling. Thank you for watching this video. I hope this video will help you understand how God products are unique and different. Uh, please go to our website, guardbags.com, and check out our entire range of saxophone, kick bags, wheelies, and accessories to find something that suits your needs and will help you arrive at your next gig relaxed and refreshed.